All right, y'all, it's Megan again. Hopefully this video doesn't take too long because I can really only do it one time. I can't retake. But someone was asking about the shoestring method of keeping the humidity stable. So right here, I have a pair of Kiwi shoestrings, cheap old stuff. And what I do is I take off the lid of my 360. I've been trying to wear gloves to minimize any sort of contamination and wiping down all surfaces with alcohol and or hydrogen peroxide. But what I do is I have a dish, coffee cup, what a solo cup, it doesn't really matter as long as you're willing to refill the cup. And I feed the shoestring from the inside out into the bowl before I set the eggs. Try to do it as quickly as possible. So, and depending on your humidity, you can pull some of the shoestring out if you need it to be, you know, um, drier in there. But if you need more humidity, you can take a uh, pair of clean tweezers or whatever and feed it into here. So what I do is typically in port A, the one you use first, I put a, the better part of the shoestring in there so I can um, pull out the shoestring as I need to. And so half and half-ish. And then you can, later on when it gets down to lockdown, you can feed this second shoestring into port B, but I have found it to be easier to just feed the shoestring into port B. Put it where you want it, which is I wrap it around um, the well here in B, like so. And I seem to like that. So then I put the plug in B. And then when you're ready, you can take the plug off and pull the shoestring out, put it in the water, and control the humidity uh, like you always would, except for you don't have to add water to the ports constantly. You just add it to the bowl. And you can also use, of course, the little window thing on the front to um, take your humidity up and down. Um, so that's the shoestring method. There you go.